Hello there everyone, welcome back to another tutorial on Loom Lessons. Today I wanted to show you a tip. Uh, on Google Chrome, you can open as many tabs as you want. You can even group them like this. But uh, when these tabs pass a certain number, you cannot keep track of where a particular tab is located. So let's say I was opening multiple tabs doing different things on my browser, but I do not remember which particular tab I was viewing and I want to, I want to jump to it quickly maybe in a demo or uh, while I'm, I'm showing a friend something. So what you can do on the latest version of Google Chrome, make sure you've updated your browser to the latest version. At the top here, you'll see a carrot button like this one. Just before you see these other window buttons, it might look like this on Windows. On uh, Linux, it might look different, but it will uh, most likely be at the top bar. Just click on it. Then it will open for you this pop-up from which you can search any tab that you are viewing and also this pop-up uh, the best thing with it is that uh, it shows you the tab and the title to the tab so if you don't remember the name to your tab you can actually scroll through these items and then check for the particular tab you you are looking for and then just click on it like this and then the tab will be activated and you can uh, continue with whatever you are demonstrating so for our case, we'll just click on this current button and then we want to search for a particular tab that we have opened but we do not remember where it is exactly. For instance, let's search for this tab right here. So we'll just uh, go to our current tab in which we were looking at and then we'll click on this search button like that it will open for us this pop-up window or you can just press ctrl shift a on your keyboard to open this pop-up so just press ctrl shift a on your keyboard and then we are we are looking for a link that points to iq broker so for this case we'll just uh, scroll through our pop-up like this for the open tabs if we cannot locate the tab or if our list is too big you can just search using the domain name like iq broker like that or if you remember the title to the page you can just search with the title for instance you can just search with instant access as you can see it has brought us a matching tab and then when you click on it it will activate that particular tab for you then uh, remember for this uh, particular browser session on this profile if we click on this search button it will uh, also enable us to see the recently closed tabs. So if you've closed a tab and you don't remember which particular site you are looking at, this can also come in handy. You can just come here and look for that particular tab that you've forgotten its name or its title. Let's say I was uh, reading BBC Sport. Just click on it and then it will open for you that recently closed tab on a new tab. Then also this uh, can come in handy if uh, let's say you are reading something or you are doing a research and then you've forgotten the link to that site. So you can just open this window and then search. For instance, let's say you are reading something on uh, COP26, africannews.com, but you, don't, you do not remember the link to that particular article that you are reading, and uh, you want to look for it later on. So you can just open your browser and then search for Africa, Africa News. Then uh, this, this pop-up will filter for you all the tabs that you've been viewing from this particular site. And then you can just look through the results and then click on that particular link that you are reading on before. So thank you again for watching. That's how you can use this cool feature added on Google Chrome. Remember to click on the like button if you like this video. See you soon.